<sighs> Rest in peace, Akira Toriyama. I'm a, the guy who created the anime series Dragon Ball Z. In his early 20s, he created the mangas and he made Dragon Ball Z. One of the best animes he's ever in pop culture history. He, he created the mangas, he created the cartoon. The story follows about a, about a boy named Goku on his quest to search for seven Dragon Balls. Also to summon the dragon and he can fight off against evil. Oh, and oh, Dragon Ball Z, the things I love about this anime is because, because of the the fight scenes, the intense, intense fight scenes, the storyline, the voice, the funniest scenes ever, and it was really cool. I had three VHS tapes, Dragon Ball Ball Z, the movie, The Tree of Might, Frieza, The Fall of Tyrant, the uncut version, Dragon Ball Z, Greatest Saiya, oh man, Gohan's Secret, and, and here I cut off, cut it off from a Reese's Puffs cereal that I, that is one of my favorite cereals that Dragon Ball Z has collabed with. If, if you guys remembered, I had got Piccolo, and so I cut it out uh, just to, like, pay tribute to him. And this is the Dragon Ball Z shirt that I have right here. It features Goku, Vegeta, uh, Gohan, Tien, and Piccolo. Yep, and here is this shirt that I, I got from Walmart. There's Son Goku and Tien. I mean, Tien and... Yamcha or someone else if you know all these characters and here are the seven Dragon Balls yep I watched the original Dragon Ball Z on Hulu I mean Dragon Ball on Hulu which is only on the Japanese dub version and I love what I love about Dragon Ball Z is the the fight scenes the intense fight scenes the powers the, the funny this scene's ever the storyline, the characters, they were really, really cool. One of my favorite Dragon Ball Z characters is Goku and Vegeta. Mm. Yep. But this was really, really sad that the creator of Dragon Ball Z, Akira Toriyama, sadly passed away on March 1st, 2024. Mm -hmm. I know that I'm late. Hey, I'm sorry, guys. But we are huge Dragon Ball Z fans, and and pop culture lost a popular icon creator. Mm -hmm. He has he has influenced, inspired other manga cre creators like yeah he has has inspired other manga manga creators and anime the anime creators like. Masasha Kishimoto, the creator of Naruto, and Ichiro Oda, the creator of One Piece, those po that that became popular. I'm glad that I heard about the history that they that they got inspired by Dragon Ball Z creator or Akira Toriyama, and he has like and other other YouTubers who are or Dragon Ball Z YouTubers who have done. On their own Dragon Ball Z content, like Dragon Ball Z parody videos, those like the other or Dragon Ball Z YouTubers, like Prince Vegeta, hmm. Slick Goku, who who sadly passed away a, a year ago, rest in peace, and and Devil Artemis, who created the eh, Perfect Cell versus series. Yep, if you remember all the those Dragon Ball Z parody videos, let me know in the comments. I've watched. Devil Artemis, Prince Vegeta, you remember for those guys in SSJ, hey, nine, okay, you know, like, SSJ? <laughs> <clears throat> Sorry. And yeah, even though, like, some of them, like, remember the Cartoon Network show, The Amazing World of Gumball, the episode? Oh, well, in the episode, Gumball, he turned into a Super Saiyan. And why? Well, let me explain. Cartoon Network... So after the news, Cartoon Network had this statement to say. Listen. Rest in peace to the, the manga legend Akira Toriyama, the, the artistry and 
monumental impact of Dragon Ball will live on in the heads and in the hearts and fans and creators for generations to come. Now, the reason why they released that statement, well, it's because in the 2000s, well, it's because in the 2000s, kids grew up watching Toonami, which is the Afternoons of Cartoon Network. It aired weekday afternoons on Cartoon Network. Yep, kids get to, like, come back home from school to watch Dragon Ball Z. Yep. As a lot of anime fans out there, we, er, this was very part of the child. Let's though, because I remember er, playing a Dragon Ball Z video game called Dragon Ball Z Budokai for the PS2, the one where it has like the story about like where Vegeta, Perfect Cell, and Frieza, you know, all those guys from from the whole Dragon Ball Z all series. Yep, and you remember the video games Dragon Ball Z Budokai. Hi, and there was an anime who crossed over, and Dragon Ball Z, he had crossed over with other anime. He's like One Piece and Naruto in a video game called Jump Force. I never got a chance to play that game, sorry. Yep. So, let me know in the comments below, do you, are you a huge fan of Dragon Ball Z? And put in the comments, rest in peace, Akira Toriyama. He has changed a lot of lives. Lives us Dragon Ball Z fans. So, rest in peace, Sakura Toriyama. Rest in peace. Kame! Kame!